Hey guys, so today's video is going to be another haul. I guess I'm just trying to make up for the three years I never did a haul because we got quite a few in a row. I hope that you guys don't mind. This one is going to be strictly a summer haul. Bath and Body Works from the semi-annual sale to Forever 21. We got some swimsuits in there. I'm just gonna show you quickly the things that I got from Bath and Body Works since it isn't part of the try on haul. I don't mind trying out the body spray that I got because oh my God, it is amazing. So from Bath and Body Works, so I got the Seaside Breeze body spray and this is honestly so amazing. I am obsessed with this. My sister also got the same one and it's just, oh, it smells so good. This is going to be my scent. I really wanna just go pick up more because I'm obsessed with that. It's so good. I'm gonna sneeze though. Then I got some hand sanitizers, pretty pink peony, and then vanilla buttercream. I got some candles and this candle was 75% off. It was normally $10 and I got it for $3. And the reason this was on sale is because this one is pumpkin fireside, so obviously it's a fall scent. If you have a chance to smell this candle, smell it and you're probably gonna wanna buy it. Honestly, I just wanna eat it. So I got a summer candle and this one is strawberry mimosa. And then the last things that I got are soaps for the new bathroom that Josh is working on. And this one is Sweet Sunrise Mimosa. I guess I went for a mimosa theme. I do like myself a good mimosa. Georgia Peach, Eucalyptus Mint, last but not least, Shades of Summer, Summer Tan. I just thought that would be really cute for the summertime. Well, I went to pink and I got bralettes. These are the first bralettes I've ever owned because I never thought they would fit me. I never thought I could wear bralettes because of my boobs, the way that they're shaped, the size of them, and I just never even bothered putting them on because I just felt like it was just gonna be this one big disappointment. I just was not ready to be let down like that. The reason I tried on a bralette was because I ended up buying a bra, which I am actually, I think I might be wearing it right now, so I'm not gonna just like lift up my shirt and flash you guys, oh hey, look at my bra. I tried on this bralette because it came free with the purchase that I got. So I was like, you know what, it's free, so I'm just gonna get it and I'm just gonna try it on and see how it fits. And it actually fit and I was so excited because this has no support. So I was like, there's no way this is gonna look good. My boobs are gonna be to my knees and I just don't think that I'm gonna be able to pull it off. But it, it worked and I was so happy. So it's like this, copper color it looks more red in the camera but it's like a coppery orange and it's just a razor back and i have the straps like all the way tightened so it can give me some support it was one of the best days of my life i have to say and so after trying that one on i was like let me try on another bralette this one actually does have padding and push-up so it gives more support to your chest so if you guys are bigger chested i suggest maybe checking this one out. And also this one, they I'm gonna try to link everything that I got down below, but the other one did work well too. If you're afraid to try on bralettes, just do it. I never thought I could, and the fact that I found two that I really like was just a miracle. I'm gonna go to Old Navy and show you guys. I'm just trying to figure out why they still have Christmas bags. So I got another bralette, and this was actually something that I picked up yesterday. I tried this bra on specifically for one of these dresses I'm going to show you guys, because I needed something to wear with it, and I couldn't go braless like I tried, and it was, it was $6. And this is just a dark gray charcoal color. And so me and Josh are going to be taking a vacation in a couple of weeks. We haven't decided where we're going yet. So if you guys have any ideas of where we should go, then comment down below. Honestly, anywhere because we are just, we just want to get away for the weekend. So I got this dress. It was on sale at Old Navy and I just loved the print of it is so summery. The thing that I like about this dress and a lot of Old Navy dresses is that it has like a cinch in the back. See, my problem is I have a smaller waist, so if I try on a dress that I usually have to get a large in because of my chest, it's super baggy in the waist area. It doesn't show off my waist, it does nothing for me, it's too baggy, it just doesn't work well, but with the cinching, it just sucks you right in and it's comfortable and you get the coverage that you need on top. So from Target, I got two swimsuits since Victoria's Secret doesn't sell swimsuits anymore and that's normally where I'd get them because they sell bra sizes and I never found that 
anywhere else. Now Target is starting to sell bra size bathing suit tops and I was ecstatic. And the first one is kind of crazy, but this is it. And it goes up and it ties around your neck. And this is a 36 double D for anybody that needs some reference. And the second one is actually a 34 double D. Super cute. I like the colors. That's kind of what stood out to me. The last place I went and got the most stuff was Forever 21 because my Forever 21, everything was $10 and under. So I took advantage. So I posted about this dress on my Twitter. If you guys don't follow me, you should. So, and this is the dress I was talking about that I got that bralette from Old Navy for. It's this dress. It has these flowy sleeves, the crisscross deep V in the front. I would love to have smaller boobs. And the thing is, I know a lot of people would like to have bigger boobs, but the thing is we all want what we don't have. And that's just something that we gotta deal with, you know? This is just a camouflage bomber jacket. And I just really thought it was cute. I liked it. Figured I would try something a little bit different. The last two things are probably my favorite things from this haul. And the first one are these shorts. And they go up kind of high-waisted. But it's just this gray tie-dye. And there was pink. I might go back and get them. These were $10. And that jacket, like I said, everything was $10 under. I could not even. Like, this jacket's $10. The dress was $10. This was $10. And then the last thing that I got was $8. And this is seriously one of my favorite shirts, I think. I feel like I'm gonna be wearing it so much, but it is this ice cream cone shirt. And they had so many different ones. Like they had ones with pizzas on it, cheeseburgers on it, like emojis, firecrackers, balloon animals when i found this one in my size i was like i have to get it so that is everything that i got for this summer haul i hope that you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure you give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button i'd love to have you around if you guys have any video requests please leave them down below i've been getting asked a lot to do more makeup tutorials so that one will hopefully be coming up next thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video and you don't have to your best fixed smile don't have to stand there I'm burning inside